Alright guys, I'm introducing my new YouTube series called Tips of the Week. Uh, I'll be uploading two short videos around uh, every week and I'm gonna be explaining you guys some really short mechanics that are like small tips and hopefully that can improve your guys' gameplay. And what I'm gonna be explaining today is TP mechanics and TP timings. What exactly does that mean? Well, watch this. And before I show you, uh, leave a comment in this comment section below telling me if you guys actually knew this or not. And I'm going to be showing you guys the TP timings. Watch closely over here. TP to a tier 1, 4 seconds. Keep in mind, tier 1, 4 seconds. Tier 2, 3.5 seconds. Anything in the base, including tier 3 tower, 3 seconds. So now you might think, when is this useful? Well, if you're suicide and they're trying to kill you and you duke into the outpost and then you TP to the tier 1 instead of the base, it will take you one second longer to get out and it could cost you your life. So keep in mind, if you want to escape from your lane and you're in danger of dying, it might be more safe to TP to the well than TPing back to your tier 1 tower. But now I'll show you the prime example of when this tip can really help you improve your gameplay a lot. So if you know that a TP to the tier 1 takes 4 seconds, and you only take 3 seconds to TP out, where exactly can you use this? So let's say the Legion team is pushing mid with this type of lineup. I put together a competitive team here. Uh, you have a Pebbles, Keeper, Ophelia, Torn. They're all just gonna be pushing grouping up, playing some type of push lineup, but they have a pebbles, and let's say you see all five of them mid, and then you're pushing bottom, and you're gonna push out the lane, and then you're gonna be hitting the tower, if you're ready for it, now they TP, and you can instantly TP out, now watch, who gets in first? I TP out even before he gets in, even though he started TPing before I did. Keep in mind, I'm controlling this myself, so there's huge delay. I'm TPing the pebbles myself bottom, and then I'm TPing the TDL myself out of it. So one more time, a quick demonstration. The reason why I get out before he even gets to TP in is because it takes him 4 seconds to TP here, while it only takes me 3 seconds to TP here. So this is, in my opinion, a huge tip and hopefully it can help you guys' gameplay. I'll show it one more time. So I hit the tower, he TPs, I TP out. Watch closely who gets in and out first. Boom, I TP out before he gets in. Clutch. It can always help you when you solo push, especially against a push team or a team that's grouping up a lot. Hopefully this tip helps you guys, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.